So what are the pros and cons of the scanner? Well, pros, it's not very expensive and it can do ABS, which is a pretty high-end feature on a lot of the scanners. Usually you have to pay at least $150 to get those features on the car. What else? Well, I like that it has the code severity alert, which it tells you whether there's a big issue on the car or not. So when you plug it in right away, it tells you if everything's green, you know it's good. If it's not green, it's not good. Same thing here, it's gonna go from green to yellow or red. Green means you're all good. Yellow means you can still drive. Red, you're no good, don't drive your car. There's you know, bigger issues that something needs to be fixed right away. Uh, what are the cons? Well, you know, this is specific to ABS troubleshooting. So if you have issues with uh, a specific module, like, um, I don't know, let's say a transmission module, this will only be able to get you the live data from the standard OBD functions, nothing from like specific module. Uh, but usually that kind of functionality is only reserved for scanners that are well over two, three hundred dollars. On that note, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you'd like to purchase one, I'll have a link down in the comment. If you like the video, hit that like button and I'll see you on the next one.